everyone and welcome to Ohio Valley Couponer. I am here with like my biggest haul ever. So big I had to actually come down in the basement and set up a table. So if you hear a lot of background noise that's why because I just couldn't fit this anywhere upstairs. Biggest haul probably of the year and you'll not even believe how much this cost. How much I was able to stock back up on products. That was my goal. If you're in the premiere, which I'm premiering this haul live tonight, comment in the chat box what do you think this is going to cost? What do you think I paid for it? If you're watching the replay, go ahead and throw it in the comments what do you think I paid for it. And at the end, I'll tell you guys how much. And I don't even think you're going to believe it because this is, this is a lot, a lot of stuff. So this is from all week. This has been one of those weeks where the deals have just been on point. So this was all Walmart right here. This was all Kroger. Like all this is Kroger. This tiny haul is Walgreens, and this tiny bit is CVS. So there's just a lot to talk about, and I don't want to waste too much time. So we're going to get into it. I was working towards a big bonus, the Stars and Stripes bonus, $5 on 24 rebates. I hit way more than 24 rebates on all this stuff. It was craziness. I don't have level bonuses this month, so I'm not sure what that's about. But anyway, we're just going to get right on into it. There will be timestamps in the description because I know not everybody's going to want to watch this entire thing. So let's just get on in and start with Walmart. I am aware some of these rebates are now gone, and I did have several problems, but um, be aware of that. So always check your account right before you buy the stuff. Should have practiced what I preached. But anyway, the Suave Lotion deal. These are over at Walmart for $1.72. Your best deal is to buy two of them at a time. That comes to $3.44. You can use two of the $1 off of one coupons for any Suave Lotion from the 628 retail me or no, smart source. So you pay $1.44 out of pocket and you will get back $2 on Ibotta, making it free plus the 56 cent money makers. I obviously did that twice. That was fun. The Suave Men Shampoo. And remember, there'll be a printable spreadsheet in the description for all this stuff, what I used to help me all week. This Suave Men's was $1.88. $1.98. I bought two of them. I used the $1.50 off of one coupons. I used two of those. So that's basically 96 cents for two out of pocket. I bought I had a dollar rebate back, so I got that back for each, and that was all there was to that. So it makes it a dollar and four cent money maker. My shop cake did reset um, after I bought these. So if you have the shop cake, it could be really sweet money maker. Okay, I also grabbed the Suave Body Washes. These at Walmart are a dollar like eighty-eight each. I got two of them for three seventy-six. I utilized a dollar off of two coupon that was available from six twenty-eight Smart Source. I got back a dollar on Ibotta and a dollar from Fetch Rewards, making it seventy-six cents for the two. Okay, I grabbed the Tresemme. These are oh, well, that happened. That's the problem with all this stuff. So I got two of the Tresemmes at three dollars and ninety-eight cents. I utilized the $2 off of two Trust and May coupon from 628 Smart Source. I got back $1.60 on Fetch Rewards. I had a special offer for these. And then I got back $5.60 over on Shopcake, making this free plus a dollar and 24 cent moneymaker. I'm aware the Fetch is probably gone for these now. Um, so be sure to check. I mean, you might still be lucky and have one. I don't know. But even if the first couple deals you might be able to do, I promise. There are several deals in here that are still alive and going right now. Next up, let's talk about the Poise. This is from Meek's Coupon Life. I got the Poise pads. These are $4.68 each. So buy two of them for $9.36. You can utilize that $5 coupon off of any two Poise products from the 628 Smart Source. So you'll pay $4.36 out of pocket and get back a $4 I bought a rebate, $2 for each, making this free plus a, um, or no, just making it $0.36 cents for the two, which is good towards that big bonus I was doing. Okay, so I don't know if this is even going anymore. Um, I didn't do it again because initially when I did this, I saw on Instagram it was scanning for this rebate. So I just went in the store and scanned it and it popped up that it worked for this. It reset for me today and I went back and checked it and it actually updated and it says not valid on 16 counts. Um, it actually still is scanning, which I thought was weird, but because it said don't do it on the 16, I just didn't do it. Um, but I don't know if it's working or not anymore. But these were 97 cents with the dollar I bought. I'm making it free plus a three set money maker. Okay, the Bianca chickpeas. These are three dollars and eighteen or three dollars and twelve cents. I had a three ninety nine. I bought it, making it an eighty two cent money maker. The Alka Seltzer gum. I loaded up on these over the two trips. Um, these are four dollars and twenty four cents. I utilized a two dollar coupon from the six twenty eight Smart Source, and then I got back two dollars over on the Ibotta app, making it free plus twenty four cents. The Listerine Ready Tabs are actually $2 on clearance at the Maple Avenue Walmart. I had a dollar off coupon. I do believe it's expired, but hopefully you still have one. 
So I paid a dollar and got back 50 cents over on the Ibotta app, making this 50 cents. Here is the barcode if you want to check your app to see if it's on clearance. Okay, the kind bars. Thank you to JR Couponer for these. This is $1.37. I had $1.70 shop kicks, making it like a 33 cent moneymaker for these. Makeup clearance for the win. So I got from a really nice subscriber. I swear, guys, this is not a good setup. A really nice subscriber sent me coupons. I'm in the mail. I don't remember her name. I'm really sorry. If it was you and you're watching, comment, and I'll pin your comment because I want to give you appreciation. Really, really appreciate it. I was able to put these in use. So the cover girl is $2. The face products. Let me show you the barcode. And then this one, $2 each. I used $3 coupons from, I think it was the 621 Smart Source. So I made $3 on that. That was fun. Got this Be Up eyeshadow because I don't care. I'm never going to wear it because I'm a dude. But I'm going to get it if it's a moneymaker, right? This is on clearance for 2 bucks. I had a $3 coupon, so I made a dollar. And then this Maybelline, I, I it rang up in the app at a dollar, but it just rang up for 2 bucks. I should have known that because of the tag. Actually, this tag says Revlon anyway. But anyway, it rang up for 2 bucks. I had a $2 coupon, so, you know, $0.15 cent cost. This is foundation. I'm sure I can find somebody. We can use that. Okay, another really good clearance find was the OB Organic Tampons. These were three bucks on clearance because the box is all beat up. But I had a $3 Ibotta just making it free. Why not? The Dove Deal. Love this Dove Deal. This is a new one over on Shopkick. So I got one of the body and face wash at $1.47. And I got one of the Dove deodorants for $0.97. Cents. Did all that. It's like $2.50 something. Shopkick has a bundle deal to get back $3.60. So this is like a dollar ten money maker, something insanely crazy on that. I will take that. That that works for me. Super polygraph, and some of these deals are set to expire. So I wanted to get this out to you guys today, so that hopefully over the weekend you can get out and get them before they go away. Because I bought it, people are just hitting it up. I actually was a victim of the healthy choice deal going away in the store, which we'll talk about in a minute. But like the deals are so good, they're getting hit up. So I did the super polygraph. This is four seventy eight. I had a dollar fifty coupon for these. Um, it came in an insert. I believe that's since expired, but have no fear. There are dollar printables you could use if you want. So, anyways, we use that dollar fifty coupon, and I bought it has two back. It made them a dollar twenty eight for me. If you're just using that dollar printable, it would be a dollar seventy eight, which is still great for these um, polygraphs. Really, really, really great. Um, I also forgot to mention I got the off sparkling water for three dollars and got back two eighty on Shopkick, making it twenty cents. All right, so we also got the banana boat. Thank you to Danaville for this. These are two oh four, and I had a two dollar. I bought it, making it four cents. Four cents. Now this is not in the sunscreen aisle. Over by the garden center, and if you're in Zanesville at the Maple Store, they have a ton of these. This is just by the garden center, and they have this huge like rack of sunscreens. So if you do that, it ends up making you know you can find these and get them for four cents. So really great. Okay, so next up, I got the Nair face cream, and this stuff was what got me this. And the uh, makeup paid for my paper goods. I tell y'all, the apocalypse is happening. Like, it's going to happen. The toilet paper apocalypse, I just feel it. It's going to start back up. The paper towel apocalypse has already started back up in my area. Like, I'm serious. It's already starting back up. There's hardly any paper towels at Kroger. Walmart still has some. But every time I go to Kroger, there's none. I watch a vlogger in Texas. Her area is starting. People are panic buying up paper goods again. And I just don't want to be a victim of that. So whenever I can work it in with overage deals, it's going for this kind of stuff. So the Nair deal paid for my paper goods. This Nair face cream is $3.54. The swag bucks reset for this month to get $12 back on two. So you make like five bucks on these, which is awesome. And I applied it to the paper goods. So I got a total of seven bathroom tissues. These are 58 cents at Walmart. This isn't great value. I don't even know what brand this is. Um, Cascades Tissue Group. I don't know how these are. It's two ply, so hopefully it's all right. 58 cents. And I got six rolls of paper towels. I think it's by the same Cascade Tissue Group. 50 cents. So that totally works for me. I'm hip with that. Okay, what else did I do? I also got the Frosted Flakes um, with marshmallows. Now, I talked to Karen um, on Instagram. She said her store didn't even have these sitting out. She had to ask um, the stalker, and they went back and got them for her. At the Maple Avenue Walmart in Zanesville. I just like my people in Zanesville knowing what's going on, because I'd want the same for me. The Maple Avenue store has an entire in cap of these at Walmart. So they had tons of them. So if you're in Zanesville and you want this, check it. 364, 
and I bought it has 364 back, making it free. I utilized a dollar off three printable co or um no insert coupon from the 614s where you tell me not for this as well. So basically it was a dollar money maker for the five boxes. Ba bam, that's how it's done. Okay, this Libby's corn is $1.73. The coupons.com app has a rebate for $2 back on any corn product, any corn at all. You can get ears of corn, you can get canned corn, you can get frozen corn, whatever you want. This is something that my great uncle, he likes these little microwave ones, so I would rather get that since he can use it for free. So I got these for free. Really good deal. I also got this great value bread. This is good stuff, guys. This is French Italian bread. It's a dollar. Every day at Walmart, it's a dollar right at the front of the store. And I had a 40 cent shop kick. It's like 60 cents, which works fine for me. This is good stuff. Like I'm glad to have it. All right, so the swab deodorant was a bit of an issue, but we got it taken care of. These are $1.77 each over at Walmart. Comes with $3.54. I utilized um, two 50 cent coupons from 628 Smart Source, which beat. But my store had no issue keying it in because they realized, oh, this is the right thing. I bought it has 75 cents back on these. That's already great. And then Fetch had 50 cents back. So in the end, it made it 4 cents for the 2D utterance, which works just fine for me. All right. This is the deal where I bought a has got to come through. But I already talked to some people who have had similar things happen on Ibotta. And they said that they've always got it resolved. Um, so I'm going to explain what happened. So the Healthy Choice dressings are three fifty two. I bought a pit up rebates this morning for three fifty two back. I unchecked them. They had no indication of expiring. I went into Walmart. They were there. Um, I, I mean, literally, the rebates were there. Came home to do my receipt, and they were gone, which really sucks. But, like I said, I talked to several people. They said, if you send screenshots that you have these offers, and you explain to them, like, I can't take these back right now, at least in Ohio, they're not accepting any food returns, I think they'll fix it because it was within, like, a couple hours, literally, so, and it had no indication of expiring at all. So we're going to send that into them. This should be free as long as I bought it follows through. So always, uh, I should have checked in the line. I really should have. I checked on the cereal because I was nervous about that. But I didn't even think about the dressing, which was stupid. But anyway, it, it happened. Um, I grabbed some Tide Pods, four ninety four. I used a two dollar coupon from the June PNG. We're getting another one in the July PNG. So do that. You pay two ninety four, and I bought it. Gave me two dollars back, just making it ninety four cents. And then I finally grabbed a great value disinfecting wipe. These are a limit of one here and they're like $2.98. And I had overage from other areas to make up for it. Like, seriously, guys, you're not even going to believe what this costs. You're really not. I can't even believe it. So that was great. That was Walmart. Make sure I didn't miss anything. No, I think I got everything. Let's do Kroger because Kroger's where it's at this week. Walmart started out sucking at the beginning of the week. I was like, oh, I'm not going to hardly get nothing there. And then, like, they showed up today. I was like, yeah, they showed back up today. I thought Kroger had them beat, but they really, I don't know. They're pretty equally awesome. So let's just get on into this. Let's start with the Dokalax. $4.99. There's a combination of coupons you could use here. There's $3 digital coupon. And then there are also $3 paper coupons from 614 Smart Source. But if you have no paper coupons at all, you can totally do... KCB. A KCB showed up today for these, so you could even do it on Kroger Cashback. So $4.99, $3 coupon, or the KCB, and I bought a history of ours back, making these free plus a 101 moneymaker each. That's awesome. The Oxy, my store is wiped on these. Um, these are $3.99, but I was able to get six over a couple different times. $3 I bought them, and a $2 KCB, making it free plus a 101 moneymaker. That's awesome. Okay, so the tampon deal, $4.29. We have a $2 I bought it for any Playtex tampons and a $2 Kroger cash back. It's making them 29 cents. I don't think that's too shabby. The Chex Mix, we already got into these. These are 99 cents mega sale price. There's a 50 cents off of two digital coupon I used. It is also printable. Plus, there's a 50 cents on two from the Saving Star app, just making these um, 98 cents for the both or 49 cents each. Like I said, we already got into them, so we got a chip clip. But 98 cents for the both is a great price. Okay, I grabbed two of the Vita Cocoa waters. Hopefully this deal is still available. If it is, the printable will be in the description. These are a dollar each on a sale price, and I had dollar off printable coupons. So I'm making these totally free, which is awesome. The Rise Coffee is a good one. These are two for four. This is a big money maker, actually. There's a 50 cent I bought it for each. There's a $2.99 on two Kroger cashback. So that already makes it a penny for two. But Coin Out, which is an app I tried using several years ago, and it sucked. But 
it's like coming back and they're adding new offers on it. So I'm going to start using it again. There's dollar offers for each of these. So I got back $2 total, making this free plus $1.99 moneymaker for the rise. Okay, I also did the Tic Tac deal, which is in LA, but these are $1.99 with a two on two I bought and a two on two Kroger cash back. And these are a dollar with a dollar fifty on three I bought it and a dollar fifty on three KCB. I don't think that's still available, but maybe. So check your account. Um, I did the healthy choice wraps over several days. These are two ninety nine. Had a one dollar I bought it. I had a one dollar Kroger cash back, and I had a one dollar shop kick, making this free, totally free, which is great. Um, I grabbed some craft mayonnaise. This is two forty nine. I had a seventy five cent I bought it and a seventy five cent Kroger cash back, just making it ninety nine cents. I was working towards that bonus, so I grabbed the Minner Agua. I actually had no idea I was going to go back to Walmart and do this again, so I actually was, like, trying to finish my bonus up early. Funny story, I actually had filmed this haul and had it planned for Wednesday, but then I saw all these new Walmart deals, and I was like, oh, I hate not to throw that in the haul. So I was like, well, let's just refilm the whole thing. So that's what we're doing. But this is $0.79, cents, and I had a $0.25 cent Ibotta and a $0.25 cent KCB, making it $0.29. Cents. This is bizarre. So you're going to have to pay very close attention if you want these. These razors are free, but only these razors are free. The Skidsmith razors, they're even marked around here, but the only one actually ringing up correctly are these vanilla Skidsmiths. That's it. Here's your code. This is the only one working. I don't know why, but this is it. They're $3.99 on the mega event. We have a $2 at Bada rebate and a $2 Kroger cash back, just making them free, but it's only the vanilla ones. So I don't know what's up with that. Maybe if your store's got a marked, because my store did have a marked, they could price modify or whatever, or that scan right guarantee. My store finally has signs up for that. So I might could have done that. But anyway, it's all good. I got the ones that work. So that's great. I actually had five boxes of the cake bites, but I'm not going to lie. We got into them. These are good. Um, these are three bucks each this week. There's a $1.50 I bought it and a $1.50 Kroger cash back, making them free with a limit of five. I would love to got more. And my store has been white. People in Zanesville must know about that deal. Um, I did a Luna mashup bar. This was a dollar at a 25 cent I bought it. And then remember last week I did the Luna? Well, this week I had a bonus. If I did it again, I get an extra dollar back. So I got a dollar 25 back off this dollar item, making it free plus a 25 cent moneymaker. Ed shaving cream for days. I got 20 total because my store kept restocking this and I kept getting it, like the deals. These, okay, the first time I went was Sunday this Sunday. And these were $1.99 mega. Had dollar I bought a, had a dollar KCB, but then I also had a KCB that was clipped to my car that was expiring that same day. No idea why I would have double dipped. <sighs> Sorry, the cat just knocked something down and scared me half to death. Anyway, um, I got that 75 cent KCB as well. So um, actually it was a 75 cent moneymaker for each of these or 76 cent moneymaker. So that helped tremendously. But now what the deal is, is a dollar ninety nine dollar I bought it and dollar KCB making the other 15 totally free. That's fine. So 20 shaving creams. Um, then I also grabbed a skin to mint and this was a fail. These were a ninety nine with a dollar fifty on two Kroger cash back. I thought that I bought it was still there, but it wasn't. So that really sucked. Really sucked. I believe I bought is gone for these now, which really sucks. But I'll just explain it in case it pops back up. Um, the Suave Kids are $1.99. Now, I had $1.50 off of one Suave Kids digital coupon for this one. Well, the rebate was a limit of three, so I grabbed two more at $1.99, and I used the two off two paper coupon from this 628 smart source. So essentially, it was like a $0.53 cent money maker for the three, which worked awesome. Then I grabbed the Suave Men's for $1.99. I utilized a $1.50 paper coupon from this Sunday 628 Smart Source. And then I had $1.50 digital for the other one. And then I got back a dollar on Ibotta, making it a 50 something cent moneymaker. Now, just a weird, weird thing. This one did not work for that. So I just ended up paying 49 cents for it, which really sucked, but it's okay. And I also messed up on this body wash. It was $1.99. I had a dollar digital. And I thought the Ibotta would work for this, but it didn't. And then I thought the case or the fetch would work and it didn't work either. So I just got stuck paying nine on cents for this, but it's okay. And then the suave, um, the suave professionals hair care. I did this twice. I got the fancy ones on Sunday. Then I was like, well, my grandma would really like these two in one. So I loaded up and got her three um, on Monday, I think, is when I went. Okay, so here's how this works it was a limit of three on Ibotta. I used a dollar off paper coupon for this one and a two off two coupon for this one. They're dollar ninety nine, so I paid two ninety seven after the coupons, and I got back three and I bought it, just making them free. So that works. The bread deal at Kroger is actually the same shop kick at Walmart. I just waited for it to reset. These um, good to dough bread is eighty nine cents, and I had a forty cent shop kick, making it forty nine cents. 
Okay, I also grabbed the Renews It's These are a dollar each. I had a two on five Ibotta. I had a two on five Kroger cashback, and my Ibotta had a dollar bonus if I did it twice, which I had done it last week at Walgreens. So this week I got that extra dollar bonus. Just making five of them free. The, um, Chobani Less Sugar Yogurt. I grabbed the wrong one. It's these, the Less Sugar ones. They're a dollar this week over at Kroger. Um, I had a dollar off Chobani paper coupon that they had sent me in the mail, as well as a 50 cent coupon. And the coupons are limit one each. So I just used one of each. I paid 50 cents out of pocket. I got back 60 cents for buying two on Ibotta. I got back 10 cent any yogurt. And you're not supposed to use paper coupons with KCB. It's supposed to just kick it out. So I just assumed it was not going to work because you don't use paper coupons with it. Well, this is not something I'll make a habit of, but it actually stacked and gave me the KCB as, along with it. Now, like I said, their website specifically says do not use paper coupons, but it ended up working anyway, and it wasn't my fault. I can't control what their computer does. Um, so, and they won't let me, wouldn't let me unclip it because I was actually going to unclip it just to avoid that, but it ended up working out. So it is what it is. Um, another mistake was I actually grabbed an extra Faye True Blends. We ate it, so it's not here, but I didn't get the rebate back for that one because it was limit two. But the deal was 88 cents. This one's ended too with a 45 cent KCB and a 55 cent Ibotta, making it a 12 cent moneymaker. And I got stuck paying 88 cents for one of them. The Gillette Daisy, the first time I did this deal on Sunday, they were $3.99. Well, I wish I would have waited because they went down to $3.49 the second week of the mega, which is now. But I had $4 paper coupons from this last Sunday, $6.28, retail me not. So I actually ended up making a dollar on these two, and then these were just free, which works just fine. The Similassen is $5.99, had a $3.50 I bought it, and a $2 Kroger cash back, making it $0.49, cents, and this is mega sale price. Whew, this is a lot of stuff. And then the Swab deodorant is $1.89. I had a 40 cent digital because I wasn't in the mood for the swap coupon to beep at Kroger. They're kind of weird about beeping coupons at Kroger. And then I had a 75 cent Ibotta and a 50 cent KCB. So it's like 24 cents or something, which is not too shabby. So that's it for Kroger. That's it for Kroger. We're on the home stretch. So let's talk CVS. Y'all know I kind of gave up CVS. But, but when there's deals, easy deals. They finally started giving me CRTs. I don't know why, but they did. And I had to go anyway to get a prescription because CVS is our pharmacy. Um, so if I'm there, why not? Now, apparently I reached some pharmacy reward or something because they gave me a $5 extra bucket just for using the pharmacy, which is free money. I didn't do anything special to get that. I got the prescriptions I would have got with an ACB or not. So I applied that to this toilet paper, which is $4.99. And if you're in Zanesville, the Maple CVS has fully stocked paper products. So that's really great. So I used my $5 ACB towards this. I had a dollar off any toothpaste CRT, so I used it on this dollar aisle toothpaste. That worked. And then I had a coupon for a free CBS Band-Aid, um, this Extreme Sport ones, and they were $4.99. So that was just free. And there's how that spelled out. Really great. And then a super quick and easy wags deal is these Oral-B Healthy Clean brushes are a dollar each on sale. And they're, or no, they're just always a dollar, sorry. And they're buy two, get one free. So these are $2, and then this one's free. We have a digital coupon for $3 off. So you got to get to the $3 amount. So I threw in another toothbrush at a dollar. So there's the toothbrushes. And there's the one for free. And then there's the $3 digital coming off. The digital coupon's really specific. It's a one with a crest mouthwash. It's a green bottle of mouthwash in the picture because there's several $3 coupons, but not all of them are valid on this toothbrush. Some of them have more restrictions, but this one was just off of any Oral-B toothbrushes, which is why it worked just fine on this. So make sure you clip the right one. So... After that, I just got it for free and paid my tax. Money talk. Let's talk money. So, all this stuff out of pocket is $287.85. Y'all know I don't pay that, right? I roll my money on the PayPal debit card. Every day, I would just roll it. Like, I never really paid... I think one day I came up a little short, so I paid like three bucks out of my actual pocket. But I just rolled the balance on that PayPal debit card, which I'm going to put the link to that card in the description because I know a lot of you guys have been asking about it again. Get that card. It's life-changing for couponing. So I really didn't pay that. But I bought it. Give me back $172.57. Shopkick gave me back $18.70. Kroger Cashback gave me back $68.04. Coupons.com app gave me $1.73 for the Libby's. Swagbucks gave me $12 for the Nair. Fetch gave me $5.61. Saving Star gave me $0.50. Cents, and Coin Out gave me $2. So off the bat, that's $6.70. I would gladly pay $6.70 for all this. But it got sweeter because I got the $5 Stars and Stripes bonus. Making all this $1.70. I think I can handle $1.70. Oh 
my gosh, that's couponing. Like, this is extreme couponing. This is worthy of being on that TLC show because I'm sure retail was over 400 bucks to $1.70. That's epic. So, yeah, that's my haul for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you to those who came to the premiere. A lot of fun. Um, yeah, great haul. Great time couponing. So, thank you guys for watching.